Welcome to It's Tomorrow News. I am Hena Talati. Let's have a glance at the headlines first. Strong storm takes down trees. Power lines in Hollis, US. Two killed in a lightning strike near the White House. Too critical. Landslide hits Kundala Estate in Munnar in India. Heavy rainfall continues at many places in Rajasthan in India. Strong storm takes down trees, power lines in Holes, US. Several roads were closed Friday afternoon in Holes after the quick but powerful storm blew through. The storm system cut through the southern New Hampshire, bringing down the trees and powerful lines. Woodland in the Holes was blocked off after the utility pole fell on the road and the trees fell onto the power lines onto the Federal Hill Road, forcing the roads closer. Roadblocks were also set up on the Rock Pond Road and Apple Lane, among the others. Even so said that the 700 homes in the Hollis area were without power. A pickup truck was crushed by the fallen tree and the Hollis police said that the driver was not injured. Crews were working to clean up the damage and clear the roads but said it would take some time. Scattered showers and storms were possible across the New Hampshire Friday night. Two killed in the lightning strike near the White House, too critical. Two people who were critically injured in a lightning strike outside the White House in US have died, police said on Friday. Two others remained hospitalized with the life-threatening injuries. They died of their injuries after the lightning strike in the Lafayette Park, located directly outside the White House complex, the Metropolitan Police Department said. The two other people, a man and a woman, were in the critical condition, the police department said. Their identities were not immediately released and the officers with the Secret Service and the U.S. Park Police witnessed the lightning strike Thursday night and ran over to render first aid, officials said. Landslide hits Kundala Estate in Munnar in India. A huge disaster was averted during the landslide that hit Kundala Estate in Munnar on the second anniversary of the Petty Modi disaster and 450 lives were saved by sheer luck. The landslide hit the Munnar Vatavada path but was struck without falling downwards. There were families, those in Kundala and other estates living below. The people who were travelling by this road during the night were first to notice the landslide. The families were shifted from their houses after being altered about the situation. The Munar Vatavda route was completely covered with the debris of huge rocks and mud. <laughs> Heavy rainfall continues at many places in Rajasthan in India. Heavy rainfall continued for the third consecutive day on Friday when many places including Jaipur witnessed heavy rainfall. Jaipur Met Office further stated that heavy rainfall will take place in the Ajmer and Jodhpur divisions of the state and in the rest of the state, mild to scattered rainfall will continue. Kushalgarh received a rainfall of 110 mm which was highest in the state. People in Jaipur woke up amidst cloudy yet humid conditions. In the evening, many localities in the city including Malviya, Nagar, Jagatpura, Tonkapathak, Gopalpura, Rajapark, Murlipura and a few others situated on the Sikhar Road and Ajmer witnessed heavy rainfall. It again caused traffic chaos due to the rampart water logging. Those who were returning from their offices got struck in the traffic and witnessed breakdown of their vehicles. Jaipur Met Office said that the rainfall varying from the 40 mm to 20 mm will receive in various parts of the city as the city rainfall was mainly scattered. Heavy rainfall was witnessed in the districts including Baswara, Dungarpur, Udaipur, Sikar, Nagaur and Jaisalmer. Jaipur Met Office further stated that the southwest monsoon is active in the state and will continue till Sunday. That's all for now. For more news updates, stay tuned with us. It's tomorrow news. For more global weather updates like this, subscribe our channel and hit the bell icon for regular updates.